Do carbs make you fat or is that just a myth? And how can you adjust carbs to your benefit? If you're tired of conflicting advice, this video is for you. Now in terms of keto versus moderate carbs, both can have their strengths. Low carb can be better for increasing insulin sensitivity and stabilizing your blood triggers if that's an issue for you. Yet these two points can be argued anyways because people that are not low carb typically eat more junk food leading to overeating Eating, leading to insulin resistance, causing obesity, blood sugar issues, and diabetes. Whereas moderate to high carbs can be better for some people and will not contribute to fat gain so long as you're staying within your caloric maintenance. It's undoubtedly better for muscle building. You have a healthy individual going to the gym often, working out, and this will definitely increase muscle growth, performance, and recovery. Not to mention frequent training also improves insulin sensitivity sensitivity and stabilizes your blood sugars. Just keep in mind when you're going higher carb, stay away from junk food. And it's important to note, it's not the carbs in the junk food that's making you fat. But it sure shit isn't brown rice that is making people fat. What is it? Pizza ice cream, cookies, etc. because they have two things going for them. They have a ton of calories for every bite. They are delicious and you just keep wanting to eat them. And you do, and you get fat, you begin to cry. Your spouse just isn't looking at you the same way anymore. Just how you won't get super fat off of pixie sticks because you're not just eating pounds of raw sugar. It's the combination of carbs with fats. Now, fruit or fructose. Most people are afraid that too much fructose is going to overwhelm the liver and spill into fat gain, which just isn't the case. Especially when you're still under your caloric maintenance, it's going to use it instead of storing it. And there was a study showing that people that ate fructose only ended up storing 1% of that fructose into fat. He has a PhD and has actually done a lot of research. About half of that fructose, when it hits the liver, is immediately converted into glucose. Roughly the other half is converted into lactate and then shipped out to other tissues. And only about 1% of that fructose is actually converted into fat. And this remains true even at very high doses of fructose, up to 150 grams, which is a lot. Look, it doesn't matter what you eat. As soon as you go above your body's energy expenditure, being with sugar, fat, or even protein, your body will store it. And your body can turn protein into sugar via gluconeogenesis. And though if you eat a ton of fat, you're technically not stimulating insulin, but your body uses acylation stimulating protein to store excess fat into body fat. So yes, you can enjoy your fruits. 